Okay, here we go. The world has just been destroyed. We find ourselves awake. It's not clear if this is a year later or less. And we're Terra instead of Celeste. And the world map has been kind of edited in such a way that uh, you can only go to Mobilis from here. You land in the desert to the west. And uh, you cannot go to Nakia, in fact. And um, I just assume that you couldn't go like near the Imperial Continent. Um, cause I've, I've played hacks like that. But you go to the Chocobo Stables and no one's in there either. So, this is what I got on Terra for right now. Hero Ring and Black Belt. I did grind for like an extra maybe five and a half hours. Mostly just rage farming. We are playing the brand newly released 1.3. And in this new revision, Cyan has fast Bushido. They fixed his meter, so Cyan's good now. They fixed Cyan. So thanks to Fast Moon, aka Patches365, for the updates. And also, Shadow no longer gets automatically emptied out, uh, equipment-wise, after, um, you know, at the start of the countdown, uh, escaping the floating continent. But, um, I went ahead and I went through that again with Strago instead. And Nerapa at the end taught him Condemned, so it was worth it. Patches! Yes! Alright, so Patches365, the author of the hack we're playing now. The author of this fresh, brand new content. I'm so glad you're here. What happened here? Everything's demolished. Smith. Huh? Someone crying? Mama. Where's your mama? Mama. Oh. Oh, mama. This hack has the saddest moments. It's very impressive. Oh, God. It's, it's hard. Come on. It's not safe out here. There's monsters around. Who's there? More people. So there were other survivors. But you're all so young. Where are your parents? They're gone. It's heading this way. Protect the kids. Papa, Mama. Oh no. Has Kefka really become that powerful? I've been separated from my friends. Has anyone else from the outside come here? Well, there is that person in the other house, but... Another person? Could it be one of my friends? Wait! I don't know who it is. Alright, there may be fireworks outside. Might need to close the window if that becomes a problem. Apologies in advance. He's dead. But at least it wasn't one of my friends. It is Memorial Day weekend right now, so that's why fireworks. What am I saying? He was still a person. Someone must have loved him. Someone's going to be sad that he's gone. I need to find my friends. I might still be able to help them. Sorry I couldn't help you. Not in the pot. Dwayne, I'm cold. I'm hungry. My tummy hurts. I can hear monsters prowling outside. I know, I know. But we don't have any food or medicine or anything to light a fire. I can light a fire and heal and fight monsters. Food, though. 
Most of the monsters in the area are poisonous, and the crops were destroying were destroyed by rats. Those rats are probably the only thing left that can be eaten anymore. The rats have infested the fields at the north of the town. Please kill any you see. Some of them may be edible. Bring back the meat for our food stores. Wayne set up a shelter for their children in the basement. We're all right for now. Please focus on clearing the field of rats and bringing back food. I'll let you know if Dwayne needs help. Thank you and good luck. I think I already got that elixir. Alright, well, rats, huh? Rat D rat, 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 rat to T rat. Do I want to kill the fast ones? Are there ones that, like, I don't want to kill? Kill all of them. Got it. Got some rat meat. Keep the rat meat. Rat burger. Wasn't that Demolition Man? Best burger I ever had in my life. Got some rat meat. Wait. Oh, okay. So. I did organize my inventory. No, not there. Rare? Fat and healthy rat. Sickly rat. How do I get rid of it? Dude. How, how is it possible to get rid of him? Brought some rat meat. Thank you. How are things going? We're doing a little better. Thank you. Oh, okay. The rats are in the garden again. Please drive them out and bring back anything we could eat. Holy new Kuja. Rat scratch. Okay, uh, I'm pressing the menu button and I'm not opening up the menu. Uh, yeah, not working for me. That's X. So, keep it, I guess? Yeah, see? Same button. The other person. Ooh, so I'm only the second. Okay. Fat and healthy rat. You know what? I had a feeling it was probably the fast ones anyway. Not to me. Thank you. How are things going? No, not much has improved, I don't think. Rats are in the garden again. Please drive them out and bring back anything we could eat. I definitely couldn't do that. I'll try again. Hmm. <clears throat> yep. Can't go into the menu. Um, I mean, I guess keep it. So now I can open the menu. It's a sickly rat. Yeah. So now what do I do? I mean, I just gotta give the sickly rat, right? He's still getting worse. One of the children is sick. Can you heal him? Rat's in the garden again. He's found okay, well, hang on. Let me heal. Alright, so I'm just gonna throw it away every time if it's like a slower moving rat. I'm hungry, I'm scared. I mean, Katrina, the oldest one's here, they're like our big brother and sister. I wanna go outside? I feel so useless. The light took everyone. Everyone. Dad, Mom. When are Mama and Papa coming back? I don't like it down here. It's cold and dark and it smells funny. I thought there was a sick child here. Alright, so I'll welcome any tips and advice to do this the right way from here. Oh, the upper left bed? Okay, hang on. I don't know how I missed it. Oh, I see him now. 
secure. Yeah, maybe if just like one of the NPCs like mentions it. One of the kids that says like I'm scared or whatever. I think I just had to heal that one kid. Actually, I'll make sure that's good meat. Normal. Okay. That one looks like it's moving slower, so I'm gonna kill this one and throw it away. So I'm gonna throw it away. Oh yeah, I didn't take it, so yeah. Wait. Wait no, I got the normal rat, that's all. Got some rat meat, thank you. How are things going? Things are still getting worse. Fire in the basement has gone out. Could you please relight it? Rats in the garden again. Please drive them out and bring back anything we could eat. Yeah, I just hope that's always a slower moving one. Let's see, where would the fire be? Back here? Yep. Ooh, nice. Fire. <clears throat> I'm gonna equip sprint shoes. I feel like this might take a minute. Oh good, a fast one. And a normal one. Alright. We'll get rid of this one and we'll keep these other two. Oh, the food stock is good, but we could use a bit more. Like, she said that already once. We're gonna keep both of these. They were going to make it. Thank you so much, Tara. Yay! Yay! This is so well done. I did it. I helped them, even though I don't even know them. What is this feeling I have? I still haven't been able to search for my friends. I might be suffering. They might need my help, too. But... It's Fumbaba! My parents told stories of a fearsome monster sealed under the earth centuries ago. When the world was ripped apart, it must have been released. You mean that legendary child-eating demon? No, I have to do something. I won't let you eat anyone in this village. Okay, thanks for the tip.
Okay, sounds good. What about two bios? If I'm morphed. Ah! New world record. It ran. But it will be back, I'm sure. I didn't even waste that much morph meter. Celis? Locke? Edgar? General Leo? Something inside me is telling me I need to stay here. I don't understand it, but I hope you can forgive me. Oh, thanks. That, that would have been devastating. One year later. Is that... Hey, hang in there. Now I gotta feed her fish. <laughs> She's alive. Celis is alive. My chest is aching so much. Better hunt some more rats. But is this happiness or guilt? I wonder what happened to her. I'm afraid to ask. But for now, I should let her recover. For the rat hunt? Is that pretty lady really your friend, Mama? Yeah, does that say anything different? Wow, a new person! New playable character. That lady came from the water. Is she a kappa? She could be. Are we getting another Mama? I hope that lady doesn't die. Did that lady get attacked by a monster? Does this mean our parents are going to come back out of the water too? Oh no. My clothes are getting too small and Katrin's growing out of hers too. If I want to be a father, I really should be stepping up more. That woman, is she a friend of yours? I'm so happy you finally found one of your friends you've talked about, but... I'm also worried that means you'll leave us. With the baby on the way, I don't know how we'd manage. Hey, maybe your friend will stay to help out instead. Oh yes, you should ask her to stay. It would take some burden off you too, I'm sure. You recovered enough yet? Are you awake? Tara! Is it really you? I'm so happy to see you're alive. I haven't seen anyone else in a year, so I thought... I thought no one else had survived. I thought the same. I do know that there are many who didn't make it. I thought that I was all alone in the world. But I know for certain that Locke must be alive. The rest of our friends must be too. Finding you is proof of that. And how does she know Locke's still alive? Because Sid died. And then she tried to kill herself, and then, like, when she didn't succeed, she saw the bandana float ashore. For those who forgot, because I, I haven't let Sid die in a long time. That's how it goes. And really, it is more emotionally hard hitting. Anyway, let's work together to find the rest of them. I. I can't. Why not? Kafka is going to continue to drive the world further into ruin if no one stands up to him. The longer we do nothing, the more people die. I know, but... The very day the world fell, Kefka turned some kind of beam on this town. All the adults perished trying to save their children. There were only children here. The moment I arrived, I felt needed. I don't know why I put in this much effort for them for so long. No one made me protect them. I just had this weird feeling, and then... The moment that feeling took root, I couldn't leave. I feel like I'm on the verge of figuring something out, but I can't explain it. And the more I try to understand it, the less inclined I am to fight. You sound like General Leo. Huh? 
Always playing it safe, worrying about what would happen to his troops if he took too big a risk. Like questioning Gestal or standing up to Kefka. I suppose I have the luxury of not having anyone important to me left. Let's see. So long as you're not confronting the source of these people's misery, are you really saving anyone? I'm sorry, Tara. You finally found one of your friends. I feel like we drove her away. If only I was more responsible. You're one who's had to bear all our burdens. No, don't apologize. You've never been a burden to me. But Celis, my friends... Ah, Mbaba's back! Oh no, and Celis has only just recovered. That monster gets her because of me. Terra! I did a lot of rage farming, and in so doing, learned just about every magic spell available for every character. <laughs> With like, just maybe a few exceptions, like Drain. Grinded experience by having to play through a floating continent twice. But it was worth going through it again with Strago because I got to learn Condemned from Nerapa. Another monster! It's so scary! Make it go away! Is you, isn't it? I can tell. Hmm? Mama? Tara? Mama Tara! I'll fight. I understand, without even realizing, this feeling stirring inside me. I'm sure it's called love. This world is to have a future. I must fight not only for those still alive, but also for those yet to be born. Dwayne, I need you to protect Katarine and the baby inside her. Listen, children. Mama is going to go off and fight for your future. I'll come home as soon as it's done. Mama. I'm not gonna cry, me either. Promise you'll come back, good luck. Thank you. You all helped me to understand a part of myself and what I need to do. I'll fight for you and everyone else to create a world where you can, can, where you can thrive. You sure you're okay leaving them? With Humbaba gone, 
They should be safe for now. And Dwayne's gotten really good at killing rats. You said you were sure Locke's alive? Have you seen him? Do you know where he is? No. Haven't been able to do any searching yet either. But I did find this. It's enough to keep me going. A year ago, Mobleeds was the only place I could reach. I never saw any other people or anywhere else to go. Things may have changed since then. Together, I'm sure we'll find someone. Yeah, I mean, I'll give... Let's see... Uh, I mean, she can have... No, actually, she can have earrings. She can have the hero ring. And what else? I mean, maybe black belt. Alright. I guess there's nothing else to do here. Wait a minute. Yeah, no, I do need to take a nap. Let me know if there's anything else I gotta do here before I leave. Oh wait, Magicite, derp. Sure. Wait, I didn't check her equipment. Oh, okay. That's probably not what I want. No. Wait a minute, did I do the same for her? No, derp. Oh my god, give her some magic for crying out loud. Yeah, like he did drop it originally. Someone who played through this game told me that they never found the Fenrir Magicite. I give her the black belt though. Oh man, should I put on the ward bangle? Oh no. Close call there. Actually no. She can reabsorb magic. Wow, nice crit. Jesus. Do I need to equip, equip a relic? Please, mercy. Yes, he wasn't here last time. Even if the world is ripped asunder, raising chocobos is my life. Like I'd never quit. Chocobo ride, 100 GP?
Okay. I'm coming, Saban. I oh. I'm coming, Edgar. I'm coming. Jared. Uh oh, wait a sec. Oh, here we go. New. Of course. Tokobos are like the cockroaches of the Final Fantasy universe. Alright, let's just start this, but uh, I'll probably take a break soon and, you know, save more for another time. But for right now, ooh, this is new, a town, so there were other survivors. Let's ask if anyone has seen our friends. Okay, maybe I won't stop so soon. We need to live inconspicuously so now so Kefka doesn't find us. I heard he wiped out every last trace of the old Gestalian Empire. There's no one in here, I don't think. Better make sure. Yeah. Now you like this, come on. After the end of the world, I woke all alone in Doma Castle. You sleep there, demons invade your dreams. Ooh, I shudder just thinking about it. The road you found here used to be underwater. Enhancer? Maybe I'll buy two. Well, one for now. Wait, hang on. Let me just see. Is, is it better than what she's got? Ooh, yeah, it is. We'll buy another one. Cool. Wait, what about armor, though? Oh, okay. I'm gonna buy... Three of these, because Edgar will join me, I'm sure. Diamond Helm, I mean, I have, like, Priest Miters, so I'm still good. I have those, I have these, I have... Oh, I don't have that. Do I want one of these? So, Diamond Helm. I should probably buy one just... Just to check it out. I should probably buy one of these just to check it out. I got so much money. Like, for real, though. Alright, Diamond Vest. That's some pretty good defense at the cost of some magic power, but... Oh, the magic defense is good. Yeah, I'll buy another one. You took one look at me and thought I was a loser, right? You're obligated to buy from me now. Interesting tactic. The port of Albrook has been blocked by rubble. At least the ferry to South Firo is still running, if only barely. These are hanging out at the pub. They all escaped from Firo Castle. Firo Castle had an accident while under the desert and is stuck there. We're in the castle through a secret cave that only we knows about. The dungeon ended up getting connected to the sandworm nest. We followed their tunnels back to the surface and escaped. The boss wants to sneak into Figaro Castle. He wants to get our booty back from the storage room there. Our last boss bit the dust that day. Now our boss is Jared, who we met here in town. <laughs> you met him in town, now he's your boss? Alright, let's go. I would have really liked to see how that got explained. I've been chatting with the boss of this gang, Jared. He's kind of handsome. What do you want? You're Edgar, aren't you? Edgar? Enough of this nonsense. Take it, I'll take one of those. I need to get everything prepared to board the ship to Figaro. I don't have time for this. Don't play possum with me, Edgar. Or have you somehow lost your memory? Listen, I don't know who you think I am, but I've been this savvy scoundrel Jared all my life. A lesser man might become distracted by the attention from two lovely ladies. 
You're right. I guess Edgar is lesser man than you. Now hold on there. Let's not go disrespecting the king. <laughs> he may be a bane to us thieves, but even we can't ignore how charming he is. And handsome. And smart. And funny. And generous. And humble. Really, it's no wonder he can't keep the ladies off his back. Wherever he is right now, that is, I'm sure he's simply awash in the attentions of women. I know it's been a year, but that's definitely Edgar in a different outfit, right? Maybe someone's controlling him. Or maybe he's having some kind of post-traumatic identity crisis. Whatever it is, he's the only lead we have right now. Let's follow him. Seems they escaped off Figaro Castle's dungeon. So I take it you fellows know the way into Figaro Castle? <laughs> Do we ever! Lead the way. Once we're inside, I'll take command. They're not in the cafe, I don't think, are they? Oh wait, perhaps they are? Vero Castle had an accident on the desert. No air down there, so the people inside are probably... Some guy came through a while ago looking for a secret treasure of resurrection. Restoring Figaro Castle. That treasure is rightfully ours. That sweet little girl stopped coming around right after the world ended. Oh dear. Now all these thieves are demanding all our time. Whew, I'm exhausted. Figaro Castle disappeared the day the world became unzipped. There we go. Coming to help. Just wait a little longer. Are you people still here? You are Edgar, aren't you? Boss, everything's ready. Let's go. In case of mistaken identity, my dear. Give it up. I'm pretty sure it's all there is to do here. Thieves have all left town. Alright, so I saved everything for the world of ruin. See? Pay dirt. I could use some holy water. You can't just wow in despair. We have to rebuild the town. They may be thieves, but they've got that glint in their eye that says they got something to live for. That means we can't give up either. The light of judgment should burn our town down a hundred times. We'll build it a hundred and one times. Oh, my dizzy. Someone's got nothing better to do with his free time. Did you hear Duncan's alive? His wife said so. Duncan's what? Oh. No, dear. Duncan's still alive and well. He's meditating just north of Narsh. I talked to his force ghost. My grandfather was a servant for the richest family at the north end of town. I'm so relieved to know my grandchild's alive. Actually, wait. Did I save anything here for the World of Ruin? Was there anything here? Okay, that one probably wasn't worth saving. I didn't save the elixirs though, I always grab those from the clocks. Did it? Oh, I need to check the weapon and armor shop though. Just before I do that.
Okay, that, that's why I saved. For later. I think some of these things change, maybe some don't. Diamond armor? Oh shit, already? Okay, fine. You know what? Bye. Two, three. Yeah. Four. Five. Whatever, I got money. I'm good. Damn, damn, damn. I'll probably sell some stuff later. Okay, got one already. Got one of those too. Got a couple of those. What's uh battle power? 135? 112? Oh, I should buy another one of these for Edgar. Oh, nope, no, I shouldn't. Wait, 139? Yeah. You can have that. Almost forgot this. Oh, Mega Potion! Okay, that was worth saving. Can I talked to you already? Yeah, we did. I don't have a hometown to return to anymore. Jump on the turtle. Oh, jump on the turtle. Oops, never mind. Chung, 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 chungus. Just when we thought the Empire was gone, here's Kefka. There's always a nasty draft in this room. Where's it coming from? Yeah, I don't think I need to go back down there. I'm pretty sure I got everything from there. <laughs> oh, yeah. That may be everything I left. Uh, did I grab anything from in here? I can't remember if there was anything from in here. Maybe, maybe not. Probably just an elixir in the clock, which I would have gotten. <sighs> Alright, I think now is probably an okay time for me to take a break. Because I will just kind of fight some enemy formations here just to get them, and, you know. Uh, but anyway, yeah. Thanks so much for so, thanks so much for watching. Thanks to, to Patches Dude 65 for the recent updates, um, which we are playing right now. We got fast Bushido Cyan, which is great, um, and some other changes there. Still waiting on you know um, a sprint toggle or or a default sprint, but. Um, yeah, you know, it's uh, enjoying all the new content, so looking forward to more next time. <laughs>